The goal was to have an all-in-one solution. I'm going to use an example of, of one of our um, secretaries of a partner. And so let's say they were planning a, a client meeting. Well, they may book it on their their attorney's Outlook calendar um, so that they can invite the attendees. But then they had to go into a completely separate program to actually book the room, order the services. And then they had to remember if there were changes made, changes in date, changes in time, changes in service, they had to make that into two locations. They had to remember to cancel meetings. They had to, and they were forgetting to do that. So we really wanted to kind of bring everything into one program so that we could um, make it easier to manage for them and for us. So my name is Suzanne Holloway. And I work for Evershed Sutherland, which is a law firm um, here in the U.S. And I am the conference services manager, and I manage four of our eight offices. Hi, my name is Dale Pollack. I'm the conference services manager for Evershed Sutherland uh, law firm. Uh, my location is in Washington, but I actually pr provide support for five other offices total. We were introduced first to the visitor portion of the, the visitor management portion of the of the program, and that is because we started to explore um, getting our ISO certification. And part of that is managing our visitors so that we know where they are at all times and we can show documentation of that. And so that's what led us to ask Cody to begin with. And that was the first portion that we um, brought on board. But when we realized that it was working well and that there was more to it, we really wanted to find a, a solution that was going to be a one all in one. One solution. They wanted to have something that would inter integrate um, with Outlook so, and then also was able to communicate to the meeting attendees as well as to other all the services that we uh, have purchased along with Ask Cody, which is uh, the conference services, audiovisual support services and facilities so that we could communicate the meeting needs in one whole package um, rather than having to communicate individually by you know separate emails and so forth which is what we had to do with our last product when we were in the investigation process we found that a lot of the different solutions that are out there they had something that sort of fit your your um your needs and they tried to force it to, to make it we can do this or we can make it do that but it was never a complete solution um, we did find that ask cody was the only one that was was really robust enough to provide all the services that we needed um well i utilize ask cody every day you know the I mean, one of the first things i do when i get to work is is log on to ask cody and pull up uh, central and look at you know what's going on for that day and tomorrow and the following day for each of the offices that I manage so that I know where we stand with meetings and visitors the uh, visitor offices and how many people are arriving and departing um, because that all plays a role with my reception team. Ask Cody affects our daily work tasks in a couple of ways. Um, you're looking at both the end user side and the what I call the, the management side. And so for I think for the end user side, as I kind of talked about a little bit before, it helps streamline everything. So it brought everything together. They're not having to worry about managing that same event in several locations. They can do it all in one location and still and with this new added visitor part. From the management side, it makes it easier because everything is in one place again also for us um, but it also we had with our previous program we would have to produce a lot of manually typed reports um, for our service providers. So in order for us to tell our audiovisual department what they needed to provide on a daily basis for that day's meetings or the catering department or whoever it was we would have to do this daily memo um, and it, it was it was time consuming and when you have to take information out, out of one program, type it into an email and send it, it always leaves room for error. And you want to limit room for error as much as possible. So with Ask Cody, with it having a very robust services program and putting the, the services in the hands of the service providers, it lessened that load on us. The fact that you can manage each um, reservation for a room and each request that is needed for that event or meeting all under one platform is a big uh, help with organizing my day. Some additional benefits that we've seen with Ask Cody is in our visitor management program for our receptionists. So with the um, 
with the requirement that they have to register the visitor ahead of time, we're a lot more prepared, um, our receptionists are, for when the guests arrive. Um, we know ahead of time, we've alerted security. We know what time to expect them. If we need to have something available ready for them, whether it be an access card, um, directions to a particular conference room, um, any kind of instructions, we can be prepared for that. Sales process was 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 easy. Um, we we had a great team and continue to have a great team that we worked with. Um, they answered our questions. They spent a lot of time with us. I mean, it was a very long process when when we had to get our upper management involved. Of course, you kind of get the 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 C, the, the chief operating officer and and special projects folks, and and they've got a lot of requirements and a lot of questions, and they were very patient through all of it. Um, Colleen, who is our uh, had been our main um, um, point of contact, has has continued to be that even when I'm contacting help desk um, for something, which by the way, your help desk is fabulous. If something can be corrected or something doesn't seem to be working properly, they're on it and they, they're they very communicative 